everyone. This is my first YouTube video. My name is Shauna. I'm 37 years old and I love YouTube beauty videos and I have been watching them for about a year and uh, learned a lot. Love these videos. Even though most of them, they're all younger than me, I still learned a few things from them. And I wanted to show some of the things that I love from the beauty world in 2014. The first one is the Origins. This is skincare, and I always see people moving it forward, so if you can see it. It's the Origins Drink Up Intensive Overnight Mask. I actually heard about this from Ingrid, Miss Glamorazzi, and uh, I tried it. I love it. It's an overnight mask. You put it on your face uh, two times a week. I sleep in it. You could tissue off the excess, but I don't. And it just makes my face really soft. I really do enjoy this, and I recommend it if you want something kind of just to treat yourself and make your face soft. Another thing I have found is the, this is Taylor by Taylor Swift Perfume, and I absolutely love the way it smells. I'm not a huge Taylor Swift fan. I like her, but I'm not a huge fan. I didn't buy it because it's Taylor Swift, but it smells so good. It's like a um, powdery scent, but not in a bad powdery baby powder way, but it will stay on your skin all day long. Like it smells so good. Like you can just, oh, it's great. I love it. It's one of the best. All right, moving on to nail polish. This is Up the Ante by Revlon, and it's the Color State Gel Envy. I love this stuff. It's on my nails right now, so I really like it. Um, <clears throat> I heard about it from Estee Button, which is younger than me, but again, I absolutely love her videos. That's my baby in the background. She's nine months. I am the mother of three. I have two boys and a girl. The boys are at school. They're 10 and 7. So she's helping me. We'll see how this goes. All right. Another absolute favorite that I heard from the beauty world is the beauty blender. Oh, my gosh. I had the um, brand from Walgreens. I don't, I don't remember what brand it was, but I got it at Walgreens, and it was a dupe for the um, beauty blender. It is not the same, absolutely not the same. Don't get the cheaper brand. I got the cheaper brand and I was like, why is everybody absolutely loving this thing is so hard. Um, then I went and bought the Real Beauty Blender, which is kind of pricey, it's $20, but oh my gosh, so worth the money, absolutely worth the money. Get the, get the, the real one, don't get the fake. Let's see, moving on to eye cream. Well, whatever you call this, the dark eraser circle stuff. I used this, the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind, which everybody and their whole family uses on the YouTube world. I love this stuff, I agree. It is the best stuff ever. You just put it under your eye and then you use your beauty blender and you just kind of pat it on and it instantly gets rid of all that. I love it. Another one that I like is the Garnier Skin Renew. I like this too. It is really cold, like you put it on because it's the metal rollerball and it's really, it just, it's really cools it and gets rid of the dark circles. I love it. I recommend this, Garnier. I like it too. All right, another one from the beauty world that I heard about, and I'm not sure who I heard this from. Maybe Judy's Time. I don't know. One of those. But it's the Rimmel Color, sorry, Rimmel London Stay Matte Long Lasting Pressed Powder, and mine's in transparent. I love this stuff. It's really soft, and it's really like you can see it, but it's not like a cakey, powdery feel, and it's cheap. I like it. Works great. Let's see, moving on to eye, eyes, eyeshadow. The Naked Urban Decay Basics. I guess this is the original basics. I get. I think there's a two, but I only had the first one, which has these. I love this neutral palette. It's easy, it's soft, it goes on good. It's wonderful. I recommend it, works for me. My foundation, 
I have used every foundation I think that there ever has been on drugstore. Maybe not so much the higher end brands, but I've used a couple. But my favorite is the Revlon Color Stay Makeup. Um, in mine's in 150 Buff to keep checking on the baby. I absolutely love this stuff, and it. I'm wearing it right now. It goes on perfect. It covers your flaws, which holy moly, I got some flaws. I've got brown spots from being pregnant, the pregnancy mask, I've got it all. And this stuff really covers. I really, really, really like it. I highly recommend that. And I think it's, I have a hair. I wanna say $12.99 at Walgreens, maybe, maybe a little cheaper, but there's always coupons in the mail, always. Like if you look on your Sunday paper, there's always coupons for Revlon. Um, I have this bronzer that I actually got before I started watching YouTube. I think, um, it was at Sephora and a lady had done my makeup and I love the way she did it. But you do hear about this everywhere in the makeup world. It's the Laguna bronzer and it has seen much love. Lots of love. But I love this stuff. Um, I don't know if I'll be repurchasing it so quick because I want to try all those new ones out there. But I do like it a lot. Another one that is from NARS, that is a blush, is the Armour, 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 I don't know how to say it, but I love it, and I got this the same time that I got the Laguna bronzer, I loved it on my um, face, absolutely love the color, it's beautiful, and it doesn't, you know, look really cakey, sometimes blush looks really bright and cakey, but this one didn't, all right, oh, Illuminators. I did not know about Illuminators or anything before YouTube World. I don't know where I was, but my life has been changed because I love them. I want to try the Becca highlighter because I've heard so many good things about the Becca. I have not used Becca, but oh, I really want it. I got the Baked Gelato Lace Illuminator in Ballerina by Laura Geller. It's so pretty. My mom got this for me in a um, QVC packet. Like it came in a big, huge Laura Geller stuff, which I love Laura Geller. It's great. And you can always find good deals on QVC for Laura Geller. But this just, I'm wearing it right now. I don't know if you can tell because um, this is my first time doing this whole thing. So, But this is the, the um, shine it gives. And it's so pretty. Absolutely love it. I highly, highly recommend this stuff. I, again, haven't used too many, but this is, so far, my favorite. Last but not least, of course, is the um, lipstick. And this is Tarte, and it's called Rare. And their lips, lip cream, lip surgeons are amazing. I absolutely love them. They, they smell so good. They smell minty, and they go on so smooth, and they're just perfect. This one is, again, called Rare. Um... I don't know if you can see it. I can do a little swatch. I don't know how this works, but it's a really pretty color. And it goes on so smooth, and it just hydrates your lips. So, there you have it. Oh, one more. No, that's it. Mm, yeah. Did I do a thing? Yes. So, that's it. Like, again, I'm so new to this. I don't know really what I'm doing. Please be kind if you do watch this or you can give me some pointers or some tips. I know I don't have the special camera and all that stuff. And I, you know, I watch videos all the time. I really do love them. But there's nobody out there that's like older than in their 30s. Or if they are, they don't look it. So I just wanted to kind of do something for people who maybe are a little bit older and moms. And don't have a whole lot of knowledge on the makeup world because I don't. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please be kind.